In 1841, Theodore Parker, a Unitarian minister, delivered a sermon called The Transient and the Permanent in Christianity. It was a groundbreaking sermon in that Parker argued that Christianity itself was only essentially a passing phase and that really the religious impulse in humanity was, as a permanent thing was a certain set of moral values, such as we would call it the golden rule. Now, Parker came in for quite a bit of criticism at that time. As a matter of fact, he was almost removed as a Unitarian minister at the time. But I think probably he was merely ahead of his time. As a matter of fact, nowadays, uh, theologians such as uh, uh, Karen Armstrong argue just that, that probably Confucianism, Taoism, Christianity, Islam, etc., have more or less the same basic moral impulse, which is something we can boil down to the golden rule. What's transient and what's permanent in Christianity? Well, probably how we act with each other in a, as a social animal is what's permanent. And acting better is the goal of most religions. So probably Theodore Parker back in 1841 was more right than anyone knew. Thank you.